Good tidings to everybody. We will be looking at something else in this video. We are going to be looking at the attack on the Okreka Igbo identity through institutionalized neglect. Now, we know that there are several of us Igbo people in the hinterland who do not even know about the Okreka Igbo people. Igbo Okreka is their name. Igbo Okreka. You do not even know about these people. You do not know anything about them. Most of us are of the opinion that, oh, Okrika, oh, they are the Mbamiri people. They are the Ujo people. They are the people who live by the water side. They are not our people. None of us, or few of us, know about the dual identity of Ibo Okrika. Few of us know about the actual origin of Ibo Okrika. But that will be treated in another video because in this particular video, we are more interested with the institutionalized neglect. Because we have some people from the same Ibo Okrika who are complaining. Now, look at the screenshot they are going to be shown right now. It says, just look at it well. What it says, I will not read verbatim. It says, River State Government, please come to our aid. We in Ukujiago do not have light for close to 30 years now. Just hear that name, Ukujiago. It is written as Okujiago in River State. But the name is Ukujiago. Those who are fluent in Igbo will immediately know where that name comes from, Ukujiago, because it is an expression in Igbo language. Ukujiago Mbada Abiara Yogo. That is the complete expression. Those who are fluent in Igbo can tell you what it means. Ukujiago Mbada Abiara Yogo. That is their name. Now, look at the response and the job from the same Okrika. The same people, but there's the just side, there's the Igbo side. Look at what the job guy said to him. He said, Stop speaking Igbo language in that your village. And then we will give you light. Just look at this diabolic statement. These things are happening under your noses. Umuibo. Umuibo salona anya. Anya sauno. These things are happening right under your noses. Look at the bold statement this guy made here. It's from the same Okreka. But from the just side. He said, stop speaking Igbo language. And we will give you light. Institutionalized neglect. What it means is that the neglect on Uko Diagon is deliberate. It is institutionalized. To institutionalize something means to make it practice. It, is, it has become a regular practice to neglect them of some things. Deliberately. On the basis of them speaking Igbo. Many of us do not know what is happening in some of these communities. But by the grace of God in heaven, we will make these things known to some of our people. So that you will understand more. What some of our people are passing through, and you will know them as someone one again. We are going to bring all this out. Some children who are born in Okreka do not know what electricity is. They do not know. Some born in Nukujago or Jimba, there are other communities like that, Igbo communities. They do not get anything from the government solely on the basis of speaking Igbo. We will look more into this in subsequent videos. Thank you.